Let's make paypiri chicken with nandu style homemade paypiri sauce. These are the required ingredients for our recipe. For the peri peri sauce, in a pan, dry roast 8 to 10 whole red chilies, 3 to 4 green chilies, and 2 inch ginger cut into cubes. After dry roasting them, take them out in a bowl and add 3 tablespoons of vinegar. Directly roast half red onion, preferably red onion, you can take white onion also, and roast till you get brown marks on them. In the bowl of red chilli and green chilli, add 2 tablespoons of chopped garlic and mix them. Take the mixture in a mixing jar and add 2 tablespoons of mustard oil, salt to taste and 1 tablespoon of oregano. Add juice of 1 lime or lemon and blend them together. Now add the onions and blend them finely. Now in this mixture, we need to add few things like 1 tablespoon of mustard oil. It will help it to preserve for 3 to 4 weeks in the refrigerator. And add 1 tablespoon of garam masala powder and 1 tablespoon of paprika or Kashmiri lal mirch. It will give it a bright red color. Our Nando style peri peri sauce is ready to use. You can store it in a sterilized glass jar. We took 2 pound of chicken legs and added gash marks so that the marination can penetrate properly. To this 2 pound of chicken legs, we added 4 tablespoon of this peri peri sauce. We marinated overnight, but you can also marinate for 2 to 3 hours minimum. Our chicken is ready for grilling. Place your chicken on a greased baking tray and bake it for 18 minutes on a preheated 475 Fahrenheit oven. After 18 minutes, flip the chicken and again bake for another 18 minutes. After almost 36 minutes of baking, now change your mode to grill to high power and bake for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, flip your chicken and continue grilling on high for another 5 minutes and your peri peri chicken will be ready. Your peri peri chicken with nando style peri peri sauce is ready and served. Enjoy! Thank you for watching my video and if you like my videos, don't forget to subscribe, like and share and hit the bell icon for more recipe updates and follow us on suparnakwizin.com.